the right tires for the Toyota Tacoma. Well, good morning, everybody. How are you today? What are the right tires for the Toyota Tacoma? I'm here to give you my opinion. I have had I don't know, one, two, three, three different sets, three different brands uh, of tires on my 2020 Toyota Tacoma, um, as well as three different wheels, I guess. Uh, we'll start with the OEMs, whatever Toyota puts on, whatever the flavor of the day is, and I think it varies, and it probably varies based on the contract that uh, Toyota has with the different tire manufacturers. And I'm sure they have contracts with more than one, just in the case of a shortage or a problem or something like that, uh, it would only make sense, right? So you have the OEM tires. You know, honestly, with the OEM suspension set up, they probably provide the best ride. Doesn't mean they're the most capable. I mean, they're fine. If you're not going off-road or doing anything severe, uh, they're more than adequate. Um, they're going to give you the best ride, as I mentioned, and they're going to do the job. But if you're like me and you just have to change things because I don't know how you have a Toyota Tacoma and don't modify it, uh, especially the wheels and the tires, right? So I went to a, uh, a Nitto Ridge Grappler. Uh, that was my second tire. Um, of course, it was on a 20-inch wheel. Uh, that was a bad combination to begin with. You should never put a 20 inch wheel on any truck, in my opinion, uh, because you're just gonna have a really, really crappy ride. You know, you don't have enough tread wall to, uh, to take up all the bumps and stuff in the road. So unless you live in an area where, you know, you don't have any bumps and the pavement is all smooth and no hills or no ruts or anything, 20 inch wheel is a bad idea. But anyway, I had the Nittle Ridge Grapplers on there. And while they're a good looking tire, um, probably one of the best, if not the best looking tire. And I wouldn't say there's anything necessarily wrong with them, but they didn't give me good traction in wet conditions in the rain. Uh, my tire would just spin, you know? And uh, and they were, they were rough. Uh, again, some of that probably attributable to uh, that 20 inch wheel I had on there, I must admit. But still, um, they were just rough. And I say that now because after having different tires, um, I can tell the difference. So I got rid of those and I did that primarily because I, I did go with a 17 inch wheel. Um, I went to the Goodyear Duratrax because still had a, a pretty aggressive looking tire as well as a lot of reports that it that it did really well, right? That it would give you a good ride and just a good uh, all around tire. So the Goodyear Duratrax, I have a 285-70 R17 on the truck. And I gotta admit, I think the 285-70 R17 tire on the Tacoma lifted is just about perfect. Now, you can go bigger, I know people wanna go with 35s, 37s, and then the absurd, but you're gonna run into a lot of problems. If you do that, you're gonna to have to start chopping stuff and cutting stuff and all kinds of crazy things. And I think if you just wanna go with a, a three-tube type lift, kind of level out the truck a little bit, give you a little bit more height, the tires will add even a little bit more height as compared to stock. The 285-70s are, are a great way to go, and I, I would stick with either a 17 or even a 16-inch wheel, same size tire, um, to give you that extra tread wall or tire wall, if you will, um, to absorb the bumps and stuff in the road. Now, while I think the Duratrax are a fantastic option, I gotta say, I have discovered something even better uh, and those are the tires that I recently put on my Jeep Gladiator. You know, I decided to try something different and for a couple reasons. One, for channel reasons, obviously. I mean, I run a YouTube channel. Um, I wanna try different things, both for, for myself and for you guys, you know, for content, uh, admittedly. But I went with the Falcon Wild Peak AT3 
W's, I believe they're called. Uh, in the same size, a 285-70 R17, so we're comparing the same size tire um, on the Jeep. And the Jeep is actually, I think, if I recall, a little bit lighter, maybe 400 pounds, something like that. So negligible when you're talking thousands um, than the Toyota Tacoma. So I'd call them about equal as far as that goes. It does have a little bit longer wheelbase uh, for fair comparison purposes, full disclosure. But I put the Falcon Wild Peaks on there and man, I got to tell you, Number one, they are still a very aggressive looking tire. Again, not as aggressive looking as the Ridge, uh, the Nitto Ridge Grapplers are, but uh, still a pretty darn, uh, a pretty darn aggressive looking tire. And they are smooth. I would say in all honesty that with the Jeep Gladiator, if you took somebody, took them for a ride blindfolded, replaced the tires and took them out again, they probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Um, sound wise, I know a lot of people are concerned about sound and, and are they louder? I did a video on that um, specifically on the channel and I gotta say, I don't notice any difference. I mean, if anything, they might even be just a bit quieter, which is strange. And this is compared to the OEM uh, all terrains, you know, the smooth lower tread. Um, they might even be a little bit quieter, I think. Um, as I mentioned, the ride quality was fine. As far as handling goes, I didn't notice any difference there either. I think of the, the combinations I've had so far, um, they are by far the best setup that I've had. Now, that is in comparison to the Nittos. Um, they are closer to the Duratrax, but I would say an even better ride than the Goodyear Duratrax provide. Um, and look just as good at the same time. As far as looks go, I think I'd probably put the Duratrax and the uh, the Wild Peaks maybe. Oh, there's a Jeep Gladiator. You might see it over here on the side. Um, about the same as the Duratrax, I think. I think they both look pretty darn good. Um, so anyway, I just kind of want to get on here, go over that a little bit. Um, down the road, nothing I'm going to do anytime soon. You know, I'm not looking to be a tire flipper. Um, I will change the tires out on the Tacoma to the uh, the Falcon Wild Peaks. Uh, I think they'll provide an even better ride on my Tacoma than the, the Duratrax are that I have right now. And I would highly recommend them. Just an awesome tire. And one other thing I'll mention as far as pricing goes, of the three, they are the, uh, the cheapest set when it comes to uh, pricing. So even another benefit, and to me, just a better tire all around. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. If you've run multiple tires on your Tacoma, um, which one is the best one? Which, which set are the ones that you've been happy with when it comes to ride quality and, uh, and comfort? I'd be curious to know. Also, real quick, if you're interested, check out my other channel. It is Rob Motive JT, all about my 2020 Jeep Gladiator. Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. And do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there.